There have been new and important developments in the Ukrainian territory in the last 24 hours. In the last 24 hours of Ukraine-Russia war, there have been significant clashes between the Ukrainian army and the Russian army. While the Russian army has launched several attacks on attempts to advance in eastern Ukraine, the Ukrainian army has responded to these attacks. The General Staff of the Armed Forces of Ukraine shared its daily report on the latest developments in the war. The report included the following statements. During the day of May 27th, the adversary launched 20 missile strikes. The enemy fired 10 KH-101, KH-555 air-launched cruise missiles at the settlements of Kyiv and Dnipro oblasts. Ukrainian defenders intercepted the missiles. The adversary launched two missile attacks on Dnipro. First, the invaders used 7 S-300 S-400 missiles. The second time, the occupiers fired Iskander missiles and hit a medical facility. Also, two ex-Russian anti-aircraft guided missiles hit the city of Avdivka. In addition, the enemy conducted 68 air strikes. Some of them employed Iranian Shahid combat drones in the cities of Marefa and Izium and guided aerial bombs in the city of Avdivka and the village of New York. At the same time, the Russian aggressors launched 89 MLRS attacks at the positions of Ukrainian troops and various settlements. Unfortunately, the attacks have killed and wounded civilians damaged the medical facility in the Dnipro educational institutions in Izium and New York, apartment buildings and private houses. The probability of missile and air strikes across Ukraine remains high. The enemy continues to concentrate its main efforts on the Kupiansk, Liman, Bakhmut, Avdivka and Marinka axes. A total of 25 clashes took place during the day in the above areas of the front line. To reach all actual news fast and reliable worldwide, please don't forget to follow and like us.